the 1169 is the miniature train, which for a few coppers will take you for a ride round Golden Acre Park near Leeds. In the 1930s, the locomotive, albeit a small one, ruled this Leeds Park. It's even had a buffet car. Bottle holders and rail bottles. The miniature railway here at Golden Acre Park reached the end of the line in 1938. And you can still see a bit of the old track and the platform there. And even though you can't ride the rails anymore, this park and dozens of others like it in Leeds are still as popular as when they were first created. Now academics from the University of Leeds and the University of Bradford are studying the life of parks and they want some help. We'd like to know particularly if anyone has any historic photographs of parks because we're trying to create a digital archive of photographs of Leeds parks across time. But it's as much contemporary photos as well as past photos that we're interested in. So any pictures that you have showing Leeds parks and park life in Leeds would be delighted to receive them. Whether you're having a picnic, feeding the ducks or spending time with loved ones, the park offers a backdrop for all human life. Victorian councils bought up land to create public parks. They wanted an area where the different social classes could mingle together and promote good health. And the green spaces in this city became known as the Lungs of Leeds. These days, fresh air, exercise and time away from technology is more important than ever. The Leeds Parks Project is online now, waiting for your park life history. Cathy Booth, BBC Look North, Leeds.